Hello, hello everyone, I am Andrew Dorn, also known as the 12th Kind here on YouTube, and today is some more Let's Play Metroid Samus Returns. In the previous episode, uh, we started exploring Area 1 and got a few items and also fought a Metroid. In today's episode, uh, we're going to start, blah, kick things off with getting this energy tank right here. So now, if you're playing long, you should have a, uh, a sizable amount of energy, more specifically 299 uh, energy. So let's go on through. We fall down here, and now let's jump up, and let's just start working our way around. Whoops. Here we go. Hey. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. I should probably reset that. Uh, let's pop a scan pulse. Uh, okay, so the next thing I want to show off is all the way up here. It's going to take a while to get here. When you're uh, climbing across large open rooms, it's best to hold on to the L button with dear life. Especially early on when you don't have any other uh, abilities that get you around the map. It's just going to be not a fun time if you fall. So up here, the reason why I wanted to climb all the way up here is that there's this uh, little recharge room where uh, you can recharge your energy and uh, your... Ooh, I need the bombs. That's right. Um, recharge your uh, energy and your ammunition, which is very nice. Uh, let's see. Let's use the bomb so we can go up there. Uh, looks like that needs to... Oh, hello. Yes, your bombs can be used uh, to uh, destroy those creatures. Here we go. This is the solution. No, it's not. Oh, okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's see. Do this. Ah, I see now. Uh huh. So do these, and then missile, and there we go. Missile tank acquired. Excellent. Uh, let's see. Anything here? Nope. Okay. So let's just go on up through here, and then we can continue on. I think. Yeah. Let's grab ourselves uh, some missiles. Oh, we were only one short. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, so we did that. Um, the next thing we want to do is drop all the way down. Take care of you. And let's go this way. Bomb that block right there. And we get ourselves another missile tank. Excellent. Whoops. Uh, not entirely what I meant to do, but okay. Uh, there we go. Whoop. Aha, fool. Got you. Uh, let's see, what's next? Okay, it just says Dem Vents uh, for the hint for the next item. Okay, that works. Let's head on through. And there is a missile tank right there. Oh, that takes the wave beam. Uh, let's take a moment to look at our map. Um, there's something that way. So it looks like what we might have to do is go all the way to the... No, well, that door's locked. Hmm. Oh, but did we ever go all the way? And there's some stuff down there. Hmm. Let's, yeah, let's head back that way. Because there's nothing else here. So we'll have to remember that for later. So if we go out this way. And then we can just uh, go this way. Oh, haha! -ha! Take that. Haha! -ha! Gotcha. Also, just, uh, it's so cool. Just this room with like all the, the different uh, pyramid like structures. Oh, there we go. And you can see, like, bridges or, like, maybe they're aqueducts and all the statues in the background. It just looks great. I'm a sucker for ruins. Like, any sort of, like, hey, this place has been abandoned and it's 
And it's in ruins now. It's like, sweet. I'll buy the whole plot of land. And, like, not rebuild it. Just keep it as ruins. Because it's way too interesting to not do that. Oh, jeez. There we go. Did that so I can drop down. Uh, excuse you! So rude. Uh, head down this way. Yeah, we never went all the way to the right. Here's another save room. There we go. It's because I wanted to do other things first. Whoops. Aha! Ow, ouch. Alright, get back up. Hit you. There we go. Uh, whoops. There you go. I don't know why I said whoops there. Okay, here we go. Take care of you. Okay. Whoop. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, shoot. Nope. Uh, zappy boys. So if we head up this way. There we go. Bomb that. Grab you. That's what it means by dem vents. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think, you know, one day I'll release all of my notes for, like, all of the Metroidvanias that I've covered. Um, and just so we can all, like, revel in the fact that, like, these notes are ridiculous. Oh, 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 oh. None of that. Oh, jeez. Gotta make sure. I'm always like, oh, jeez, because I'm always, like, concerned I'm gonna, like, just get knocked into the, the next generation. Alright, um, let's equip this. Charge up. And we have ourselves another Metroid fight. Gonna try to hit it, um, with some missiles. Do that, and now hit it a few dozen times. There we go. Aha! And thank you. Uh, also, something that I think I failed to mention um, is the item drops. They're different sizes of like all the different drops, and they correlate to like how much they give. Um, so, like typically, the bigger the orb, like the more of that particular resource that you get. So, like the small yellow orbs are uh, Aeon energy. The little missiles is obviously missiles, and then the purple orbs are uh, energy. And the bigger the um, that particular resource orb, however you want to call it, is, um, the more of that particular thing you get. All right, so it's beeping like nuts. Whoop! Haha. Um. There we go. That could all be blown up. Excellent. <laughs> Take care of you. Uh huh. Is any of this bombable? Yes, it is. Okay. Whoop! Take that. And just drop down here. Uh, looks like it goes through this way. Uh, let's pop a scan pulse just to open up the maps more. Okay, well, our next fight is definitely this way. Uh, we have 57 missiles. We're not perfect on uh, health, but that's okay. Just unload all of our missiles. Uh, whoa, this guy has a special little ability. Uh, he can, like, supercharge himself. And, um, he can drop a little electrical balls. And it's not a fun time. There we go. Whew, took care of him with, with little to no problems. All right. We're almost done uh, taking care of the Metroids. If I turn your attention to the bottom screen, um, we have three DNA samples, then the shrine requires four. So all we need is, ouch, all we need is one more um, DNA sample, and we are good to go. Whoops. Oh, you know what? I shouldn't have uh, done that. I actually need it. So I can jump on top and then go this way. And very briefly, uh, there was a Metroid uh, that just zoomed on past. Okay, so stun you. Whoops. And, oh, haha. -ha. Hey there. 
take care of you. Okay, jump up. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Oh my gosh, I can't reach it. <laughs> oh, there we go. Let's just wait for him to uh, do that. Excellent, thank you very much. Uh, yikes. Also, you see like this yellow stuff uh, on like the walls and ceiling. Uh, that material makes it so we can't use our spider ball ability on it. Oh my gosh, I'm ugh, I'm suffering from the let's play curse, y'all. Okay, there we go. Nice arc. All right, let's get this going. Hey, coming in from downtown, we got ourselves another Metroid. This bad boy's dropping electrical bombs, thinking he's the next hot Metroid. I don't know where I was trying to go with that. I was trying to be like, I don't know, like a WWE announcer. What? You? Ah, take that. Also, I don't think I've ever mentioned why the ice beam is effective. Uh, Metroids are weak uh, to the cold. Uh, Metroids, I guess, like, they're cold-blooded or something. Um, I think it has something to do with the fact that, like, they absorb energy from creatures. And so, like, that's why the Federation was, like, using them as, like, um, an energy source. Or wanted to, at the least. Um, it's because, uh, I guess they're just pure energy. Uh, yeah, let me just take care of you. Uh, there's a bat up there. Thank you. I will, by the way, <laughs> I, like, am slowly starting to ramp up the level of production for uh, some of my Let's Plays, especially the Metroidvanias. But the one thing that I always refuse to do is look up the official names for the enemies. Because I'm just like, nah, man, I'm going to call them the bat and the sparky dude. Why? Because I want to. That's why. <laughs> uh, here we go. Like probably like several years down the line when I eventually get around to like covering, uh, like I don't know, like the Prime games, like even like well into like Prime Four. <laughs> They'll still be com they'll probably be comments like, "Hey, why don't you use the official names?" It's like, "Cause I don't wanna." That's why. <laughs> uh, just that little bit of what makes these let's plays mine and a little unique. <laughs> official names. What are those? Nah, we got a bat and a frog. <laughs> See, classic frog. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Uh, I don't know how my friends are able to put up with me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know, the frog enemy. What frog enemy? You know, this. That's not a frog. <laughs> it's not even close to resembling a frog. That, that kind of looks like a bat. That kind of looks like a crab. But, like, other than that, like, you're just wrong. Oh... <gasps> uh, Good golly. Whoop! Ah, jeez. Excuse you, Mr. Bat with the horrible overbite. It's just the overbite. Like, there's no lower jaw. How would they feast? How do these... I guess, like, they, they like, absorb, like, the, the nutrients or something? I don't even know, man. Uh, whoop. Ow! Excuse you! How rude! Well, let's put in all of these DNA samples. <gasps> boop, 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 boop! Look at that! Ayy! <laughs> oh. Man, I... <laughs> let's be honest, I am a strange individual. Uh, but I think that's what I enjoy about my self about this the content I, made? I don't even know where I was going with that <laughs> I 
I guess if someone to ask, you know, what do you like about yourself? It's like, well, I'm a very strange individual, and I laugh at my own dumb jokes that don't even make any sense. Excuse you. There we go. Uh, I also call enemies by, like, the wrong name. So it's like, you know, just whatever. Uh, break that. Nope. Oh, uh, okay. Oop. Oh. Oh, jeez. Okay, do that. And then do that. Oh. Here we go. Uh, okay. Whoa, hello. I hit him, but, like, I didn't hit him. Uh, whoop. Haha, -ha, take that. Oh, jeez. The supercharged hit. Uh, supercharged hit. The enemy that I was supposed to hit. Oh, we can't take care of that right now. Um, we can't take care of that. Okay, we can just we can go up here though, and blow up. There we go. <laughs> I was like, we're gonna have to blow up all those blocks, aren't we? Oh, uh, ha ha. Oh, jeez. Get out of here. Finally, the elevator. Use this elevator? Uh, yes. No, I want to use the elevator that stops only on the seventh floor. And then use the stairs to the eighth. You know, get a little bit of cardio in. <sighs> what even? Oh, <laughs> uh, let's pop a scan pulse. We can see that there's all sorts of wonderful goodness here. Uh, but that is where I'm going to end it for today. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. In the next episode, uh, we will be um, really taking a look at uh, all of this crazy stuff um, in Area 2. Uh, like all of these bats. Um, I think actually real quick... Um, can we get to the shrine without having to touch the... Or Yes, there is a save point here that I can get to without touching the shrine. Excellent. So yeah, this is where we're going to end it. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is going to be the end of the pre-recordings. I just wanted to get uh, a little ahead. Um, just because these do take a long time to edit just because of how labor intensive they are for my computer. Uh, but if you have any like comments or suggestions or uh, questions about like the Metroid series and all that fun stuff, uh, specifically like with this Let's Play or even with past Metroid games and how they compare, uh, leave those in the comments down below and uh, I will answer your question there and uh, hopefully I'll also be able to address it in the next video. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time for some more Let's Play Metroid Samus Returns. Bye bye